February 24th, 2024. I'm in Savannah, Georgia at the Georgia Southern University Armstrong campus. This is the really long parking lot. And this is some Carolina jasmine or yellow jessamine climbing a shrub here. And it's swarming with blueberry digger bees who are all zipping around too fast. So I probably won't be able to get any good pictures. It's also, as you can see down here, like in a little ditch with a giant hole. So I'm not going down there, but I could try going around to the other side here. You can see the sides here. This is a native vining plant. Let's see if I can get some pictures of the blueberry digger bees. They're zipping around like crazy. Yeah, you can see them a little bit. Yeah, I don't think any of them are gonna come over here. Come this way, bees. Let me get your picture. At least you can see them zipping around. Well, this plant is really good for bees like these ones who come out super duper early in spring because it's one of the only things flowering right now, or at least one of the only things natively. Ooh. It's in that flower there. Oh, yeah. And it zipped away again. Here, yes, pose for the camera. Or don't, all right. <laughs> But it's very good for native bees, like these ones, because these bees only come out in like February. And I think they're underground the rest of the time, I'm not sure. And this is one of the only things flowering. And yeah, as you can see, it's got a ton of flowers. And these bees are very clearly filled with energy. They're not pausing. <laughs> It's gonna be a bunch of really pixely pictures. <laughs> if one of them would just come to where I'm pointing the camera already, that would be nice. Anyways, aside from the yellow trumpet flowers in spring, this is evergreen, so you'll be able to see these leaves all year round. And these here, are, oh, they got lots of seeds in them, so I can show you some of the seeds. So these are the seed pods. Interestingly, these ones are longer than on the other ones I've found so far. And then the seeds inside are just little yellow things shaped like kind of like maple leaves they act the same way uh they're shaped like that so that they'll go okay well i just dropped one i was going to demonstrate <laughs> but yeah evergreen vine with little pointed leaves and crap ton of yellow trumpet flowers in the spring Here, over here is another one that isn't flowering yet. This one's younger, probably. Not sure how old they have to be to flower yet. But yeah, once you collect the seeds from the little dried seed pods, which you can start collecting in March, or at fall. I don't know why I said March. You can start collecting them in fall or in spring here if they haven't fallen out yet. And 
These usually like to climb really tall trees or pretty much anything they can find, but they will climb up all trees. So if you're walking around hiking and you see yellow flowers on the ground like this, you can usually try looking up and you should be able to find them. Oh. Probably the best we're gonna get. What? Get off me now. Alright, this is the end of the video. Bye-bye.